Hi, I'm Miss Andrea. And I'm Miss Pauline. And we are bringing to you today a brand new program here at Smith Public Library. It's called Idea Lab. And so this is a program that we're going to do to kind of replace Lego League for right now because Lego League is a great program, but it's really better in person. So we're going to try something new. Um, and I'm going to give you over to Miss Pauline and she's going to talk real quick about the kits and how to register for them. So you can register online. Uh, there should be something in this post. And once you have registered, you can pick up the kit either through curbside or at our children's desk. Uh, each kit will change every month, so a new kit every month. Uh, and we really hope you enjoy them. All right, Miss Pauline, let's talk about what's in this month's kit. Okay, so this month we're going to have some toothpicks, some jelly beans, and our instructions here which teach you how to make different kinds of structures. So we have one that we've already started. If you can look, you can see it's a prism and I've just used the jelly beans and the toothpicks and I've used the toothpick or the jelly beans to hold the toothpicks together. So let's get started. Let's make something. Okay, right. so one thing to keep in mind if we're just going to make this a simple triangle uh, when you're putting the toothpick into the jelly beans, it can be kind of hard to get started, so you just need to do it gently. Or you can use the table mm -hmm. and do it that way, so then that way your finger isn't on the other side, and that way you protect your fingers. So we're just going to keep going here. So a little bit more for the program, it's for ages or for grades, first through fourth grade, um, the same age group for Lego League. Um, and every month we will have a new video to go along with the kits so that you can see um, what you can do and what kind of fun you can have with our kits. So it's pretty easy. Once you start putting it, it might be tricky to put the toothpick in the first time, but after you get some practice, it's a lot faster. And then you can see what we can put things together and make more shapes. Right, and so a good challenge, and I hope that you send pictures and put them in the comments. But we would like to see what structures you make, what kind of shapes that you can make, and um, see if you can build on top of it. Oh wait, how um, tall can you make things? Right, and what kind of shape will you need to make a structure and make it go tall? So those are the kinds of things that we would really love to see. Well, I hope you enjoyed this month's kit and our brand new program. I hope you join us next month where we'll be doing catapults. Yay! All right. Have a good day. Have a good evening. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.